welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am basically cleaning out my closet. I've been spending all day working out my closet and I'm pretty much done now but I wanted to show you guys um, some of the stuff I'm getting rid of and show you guys my new clean closet. So basically this is how I clean out my closet. First I well actually my glasses are glaring really bad. I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna take off my glasses first of all. Um, so this is how I clean out my closet. So first of all I go through the whole thing and just take out anything that's like a maybe. Anything that I'm kind of unsure about I probably need to try on. Anything like that and then next I try it all on. I usually ask my best friend Kaylina, who's also my roommate, I ask her for her advice on like if I should keep it or not. She usually is pretty strict on me. She's like, no, get rid of it. Or like, that looks bad. Or that's so old. <laughs> so she's a good person to ask because she will be like, girl, get rid of it. So I like 99% of the time listen to her. And then obviously some stuff if it's too tight or not comfortable I know to just ditch it so yeah and then after I try everything on I put it into a couple piles there's either a this is still nice and I could probably sell this or there's the get rid of it donate it possibly throw it away <laughs> uh, pile so uh, this is the first time I've decided I'm actually gonna sell stuff uh, in the past I've just kind of given it to friends or just donated everything but I finally decided that I want to start selling some clothes online so I will definitely be leaving a link below on my new online you know shop my closet and there's also going to be a new tab added to my blog where it'll say shop and you can just shop anything that I'm getting rid of let's take a look at my finished beautiful closet And, okay, so it still looks packed, totally packed, but I swear I got rid of a lot of stuff, and I'll show you. Um, but, yeah, so basically, oh, God, all the way in the back. These are from here. Back is all dresses, and then they're separated with this thing of, like, uh, bodysuits, like tank top bodysuits. Um, so yeah, there's some of those tucked in there. And then the rest of this is all tops. Um, so they're kind of color coordinated. We have like pinks, red, orange, green, blue, purple, and then like into all the neutral colors. And then shoved in the back here is some like blazers and sweaters. I know it's so hard to see because it's literally still so packed but it does look a lot nicer and then up top we have sweaters like bulkier sweaters and um, a pile of hoodies that's all hoodies and then back there that is like shorts and dress pants I don't wear dress pants a lot or shorts actually so that's kind of a small pile back there um, all right, so then moving on to my cubby hole situation. Up here is underwear, which yeah, you guys don't really need to see all my underwear, but that's what that is. And then next to that is what's in here? Oh, this is tank tops. Um, I think under the tank tops is like tights and stuff in there. Um, and then this is all socks. Lots of freaking socks and like some random like shoestrings and stuff over here this is skirts so this is a big fluffy tool skirt kind of shoved there and this is all skirts I got them to fit so I'm not gonna pull that out but just trust me it's a bunch of skirts <laughs> and then down here gosh this is all leggings um yeah I love leggings so that gets those get a lot of use um, next to the leggings these are pants that like aren't sweatpants and aren't jeans so yeah just really weird materials pretty comfy pants yeah um, so a few of those 
Moving on down here to jeans. I got rid of a crap ton of jeans. Like, got rid of so many jeans. There's some more jeans over here that aren't denim. It looks sad right now, but that's because I literally got rid of so many. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys those. And then, here's like pajama shirts, uh, like just stuff I sleep in. And then, pants and shorts that I sleep in. So, you know, I feel like everyone has like pajama drawers or whatever. So that's what those are. And then, lastly, over here, sorry, I know it's a mess. This top drawer is like shorts and shapewear. And then underneath, these are, I guess like sports bras or lounge bras. A lot of Victoria's Secret pink, some Fenty. Yeah, just like comfy bras. Under that is real bras. And then some more real bras in the bottom. Yeah. And although it looks overwhelming, I do still have more clothes at the laundry mat right now. So this isn't 100% everything, but you definitely get the idea. And then here we have scarves and belts. Actually, I just remembered I'm probably going to get rid of some of these too. But yeah, some scarves and belts hanging out over here. And then my sneaker collection. Maybe I'll do a video on like my sneakers. If you guys are interested in that, let me know. And yeah. So that's my finished clean closet. Definitely as good as it's going to get. Okay, so here's a look at some of the stuff I'm getting rid of. So, I decided it is time to ditch all of my uh, Victoria's Secret pink v-necks. Um, I worked there for three years, so I have so much random stuff from there. And it's slowly all leaving my closet. So, I have about every color of pink v-neck. Also, the thing that shocks me the most is I'm getting rid of so many jeans and pants. I did not realize that a lot of them that were sitting in there don't even fit anymore. So, I'm getting rid of this stack of pants. Yes, all of these are going. They're leaving my closet. Uh, a few other fun dresses. It's like this one with some mesh down the center. That's cute. That also has like some cutouts in the center. And this dress and the last one have actually never even been worn. So those, I just, I just never wore them. And I've had them for over a year. So I feel like if you had something for over a year and never wore it, probably time to ditch it. I have this like motorcycle jacket I'm getting rid of. I'm also ditching this. It's a Calvin Klein jacket and I actually really like it. But it's a little tight in the sleeves. You know, it's a little like restraining and that's never a cute look so also getting rid of this sadly a tan kind of like trench coat style from forever 21 a lot of stuff's from forever 21 honestly and this jacket uh in the words of kaylina it's a little 2004 it's a crap cropped cropped denim jacket and I love this though. I just, it's old and it, I don't need it anymore, but I wore it for years, like all the time. All the time. So I'm sad to get rid of this one, but it's time. This has also never been worn, but it is a pencil skirt in this like electric blue color. And I think it's so cute. I just haven't worn it because it's, it's a really interesting color and I don't really wear pencil skirts a lot. And. Um, just a bunch of other random shirts back here. I'm not going to go through and show you guys every single thing because honestly there's a lot. Like there's a lot of stuff here. But I'm so excited to be cleaned out. Like my wardrobe starting, you know, all fresh and new. Hopefully I wear all of the stuff that's left. If not, then I'll get rid of it next time. 
Hey guys, so it's been a little bit since I cleaned out my closet and I have a few updates that I wanted to slide into this vlog before I post it. So basically, I did make a, uh, a online store at Poshmark. I haven't posted a lot yet, but it's, it's coming along. It takes forever to take pictures for that, by the way. But yeah so um i'll put my poshmark link down below and in addition to getting rid of clothes on poshmark i also had the pleasure of participating in a blogger closet sale which was so much fun it was here in new york city it basically had i think it was about 30 bloggers we got together and brought clothing racks and a bunch of stuff we didn't want and uh yeah just sold it to whoever wanted to come by and hang out with us and it was super fun i had like a decent amount of success i probably sold i'd say like roughly 10 pieces which is awesome um yeah and it was a really fun way to like meet some followers and meet some other bloggers and just like have a a good time so that was super fun i might be doing one of those again in the future and then in addition to selling my stuff online, I also donated a huge bag of stuff to the Salvation Army. Um, there's one like pretty close to my apartment, so the Salvation Army is the like closest way for me to donate clothes. But um, when I was back in Michigan, I used to uh, take clothes to like clothing bins. I also used to try to make money off going to Plato's Closet, and whatever Plato's Closet wouldn't take, then I would also donate that. So that's just a few ways that I get rid of all the stuff I don't want. Um, I usually try to uh, sell whatever I think I can and then whatever I don't, I donate. You can also call like Purple Heart. I think they do pickups um, so they can come and pick up the clothes for you. There's a lot of ways to um, not only like make some extra money but also give back to the community and it's like one of the easiest ways to do it. So anyway. Happy Marie kondo everyone, and I hope that your spring cleaning is off to a brilliant start or finish if you're way ahead of the game. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if there's any more like, uh, like bedroom focused or cleaning focused like video ideas you have for me. I'd be happy to hear them. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, homies. I worry about nothing